Now if I put this in here so there's just a little bit of a downward there, I won't be just bending the washers. Mm. If I don't have it going downward at all on the washers, then it won't clamp. <clears throat> but if I let it go way downward, it's going to just bend the washers instead. Oops, I was wrong. They gave us 11 sixteenths. That's trouble with 7 sixteenths. They do it both ways. Thank you. It's pretty secure, and then I will turn the magnet on too. All right, I like that. That is just professionally shown. Okay, there, now we got something, now we're at zero. We'll be able to see a little bit more than with that other one that didn't travel so far. So we go about a quarter turn. Let's just pull it off. Let's make more room. That one is not hitting anything. The plate is hitting. Huh, that's interesting. Okay. The fact that it dialed in last time makes it more of a, I'm like, you know, you don't want to just arbitrarily decide to cut holes out everywhere. But it sure didn't want to move over now. These are in the block. No, those are in the plate. Plate coming into this is these Let's, uh, let's mark, we got a marker. Oh yeah, let's mark these so we don't get confused. That one does nothing, because that was just the uh, dowel pin that's not there. There's seven, seven. go to file this thing down is it all right for the tool to be there or do you want to move the tool off before it's, it's, I it's okay it's okay we'll just stick it out here so you don't have to fuss with it so much get it out of your way all right I just don't want to get yeah, yeah. metal flakes and paint chips down on it yeah it's it's okay you get metal chips fly, flying around them all the time they're kind of impervious to that actually because that's when you're on the lathe and you see streams of chips coming back at them Oh, <laughs> I was thinking of the flat bottom. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Now you can take it down with this. I've got oh. a wet pile over there too. I just felt because it was around. Yeah, no, I wasn't. I was trying to get the burr that stuck up on the flat face. The hole I wasn't too worried about, but I didn't want any just a little bit sticking up. I think we're okay. Well. <coughs> Okay.
and turn it around slowly about a half a turn is where we'll end up. <coughs> Probably didn't get my zero exact on the bottom, but we're close enough. Okay. So I started out with uh, zero on the bottom. Where now you can come over here and look at this. We came uh, plus 46. Sometimes it's a little confusing keeping track of which way you're moving, plus and minus, depending on where you set it. But this time we set the zero down there and we came plus to 46. So we want to go up to 23 roughly. See how easy that works when I got room in the bolts? <laughs> That's why I, was, I hammered it last time. I'm like, ah, a certain point where you just say, no, there ain't enough room. We're, we're binding on a bolt. Okay, now it's bouncing because I got the bolt a little too loose. So now I just give it a little bit more torque. Maybe need this one a little more torque too. Yep. Oh, goodness. Takes enough to hold it up, but not so much that it won't work. Okay, so let's just ignore that for a second. Let's get a new reading since I know we're closer anyway. Let me let me zero it here first because I think that was actually a good spot. Okay. perfect on the top and bottom but we're close we're way off on the sides so we'll go to one side and we'll look at left and right first mm -hmm. get back to that machinist on a lay that's just easier sometimes to think of it in quadrants so you got a ways to go this is not as finicky as what i was telling you at first as far as knocking it off because we've got it bolted down now and it's a bigger indicator oh, oh. okay we got zero there, run it on around a bunch. Ring right there. Yeah, somewhere in there. Okay. We're gonna go back that way about 12 and a half ish. What's Are you that? splitting the difference between your run out from the side yes. to side? Yes. Yes. Did I go the wrong way? I think so. One zero. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I did. I went oh, the wrong way. There you go. That's really You're good. absolutely right. It helps when you go the right way. It does. Okay, let's hang on here a second. Let's look at our side to side next again then. We got oil in the engine? Yeah, that's a minor thing. It's just me. I always like to put oil in when I do it because it just more times that the oil pump is going in the right direction putting oil up in it. Right, yeah. But well, we can do that. We just have to. Uh, it's up to you. It's up to you. When I set this down in here, I wanted as little on it as possible, and that's what I did this morning. Yeah. So I didn't put the oil filter yeah. on it either. Oh, so. oh, yeah. Whatever. Yeah, yeah. No. Okay. Let's just ignore it. It should have enough pre lube. It's just. Oh yeah. One of those little points. I. I get ridiculous sometimes with little no, points. No, I understand where you're coming from. You ready to go? Yep. Okay? Yep. Okay. Hold it there. 
You don't have a bigger dead blow, do you? I got a 12 pounder at the shop that's just beautiful. Oh yeah, I know they are. What size is that one? This is only a three. Oh no, it's, it's my 12. It's like a sledgehammer size. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Simple enough. Yeah, let's just run it around and see what we got. We moved it some. Not as much as I was thinking, but we moved it some. We're down seven there now. Thank you. It's a little. That's a boy. You're at four now. Negative four. No. Yeah. No. Ne yeah. Negative four. So you moved about three. Yeah. I just don't want to. Well, because we weren't trying to go to zero. No. Zero was over there. We were here at. Uh, it was bouncing between nine and seven. Yeah. So that's so, about right then. I'm kind of thinking, yeah, we want to. Let's turn it a, a little bit. Let's turn it around. Let's look at it before we get too carried away. You want me to set zero? No. Nah. No, let's set zero at the bottom. Okay. We're going to confuse and change all our numbers, but we'll set zero at the bottom since that's pretty much what we're getting at the top is the same. Well. Okay, thank you. 